eyebrows are having a major mm -hmm. moment, yes. and we know great brows can completely transform your look. But what's a girl to do if they're overplucked or thinning? <sighs> sure, makeup can camouflage your bare brows, but today we're showing you a new and more permanent way to wow your brows. Hey. Look, 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 guys! <laughs> I got my brows done. Look, Let me see, see. see? I tell you all about it on my blog. You gotta check it out. <laughs> it's awesome. And now, Lonnie, don't touch them. But no, microblading is awesome. I'm gonna I, get I it love. done. Yeah, yes, absolutely. I was obsessed with it. So joining us now to tell us about the process is brow expert Sheila Bella. Sheila, thank you for being here. Thank you so much for having me. This is amazing. Well, Sheila, can you share with us what microblading is? Because Jeannie looks so much better. So I want to oh my gosh. look better There's too. There's nothing worse than going in a pool and coming out with no eyebrows yes, on. That's true. So or what, somebody... is, what is microblading? Microblading is like the hottest thing right now that hit the beauty industry. It is different from a traditional permanent makeup tattoo. Okay. It's not a solid. It is tiny little hairs that are implanted into the dermal layer of your skin. Oh. Each and every stroke is about a tenth of a millimeter wide, and that is why it looks so realistic. And we use seven very tiny acupuncture needles, actually. Oh. It's really cool, you guys. Yeah, the procedure only takes maybe about an hour to mm -hmm. two hours, depending. So is it like a tattoo? It is technically a tattoo, but it doesn't go as deep as a tattoo. It is semi-permanent. It lasts for only two years, so you can get it done again in a different arch. That's right. Yeah. Oh. It, yeah, oh. Because sometimes oh. shapes and the trend. trend. Yes, sometimes yeah. the so shape like changes. Is it like a weave? Is it hair? Or it, what? It is pigment that's implanted into the dermal pigment. layer. Of what the skin. is pigment? See, like, like dye. Like, it's like, like, oh, know. so it's, it's like it's dye. So, like, oh, okay. back, Thank you. back in the yes. days, tattooed eyebrows, they would tattoo almost like a block into your eyebrows. So, yes. you just had a square, check okay. right brow. And then it would turn that green Ugh. color. But nowadays, oh. they have different ranges of colors. Like, I got an ashy brown. And then yeah. they just do little tiny hairs, like flick. Flick, 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 so I look like I have a fuller hair. And I have a tail, you guys. I posted it on Can my I blog. Can I see, Jeannie? Can... No, it's really fine. I, mean, I want to get it done. Oh, okay. Now, because I want to get this done, I have to ask, how much should someone expect to spend if they're interested in this? Well, it really depends. It could range anywhere from $200 to $2,000. So it just depends on who you go to. how long does it last for two years? Two years? I'd say, two, I'd say one to three years. Okay. I do recommend coming in for a color boost once a year. Yeah, okay. You know, just to keep it looking fresh. What's great about it is that you can change it up. It's not completely permanent. It's, it's so semi-permanent. Awesome. Okay, that's oh, okay. good yeah. to know. Awesome. Okay. Well, that's very good. All right. Right? Okay, yeah. well, check it out. You're going to see it in person, you guys, because we heard from Anthea, who's says she's in dire need of an eyebrow makeover and we wanted to help, of course, so take a look. Hey guys, my name is Anthea Neri. I happen to be born of Asian descent. And when I was younger, I used to make fun of my mom because she had to pencil in her eyebrows. <laughs> I'm crazy. I can't believe I'm doing this on TV, but now I have to do it. Because if I don't, this is what I have to wake up to in the morning. Wow. That looks crazy. You guys, I need your help. Earlier this morning, you microbladed Anthea's brows. Now, you need to tell us from start to finish how you did it. Okay. So first, I numbed her with a topical anesthetic for about 20 minutes. After that, we went ahead and took proportions of her face to make sure everything was even. We then laid down the design with a pencil first. Um, and then after that, we chose a color. Now, during this process, she has an opportunity to look at the design and see if she likes it. Uh -huh. um, and she did tweak it a little bit. Um, and once she, we have a shape and once we have a color, then and only then will the procedure begin. Oh, wow. Okay. wow. So, let's take a look at Anthea's brows before. All right, girl, we love you. You look beautiful, but we feel yeah. for you with those brows. We got you. <laughs> Here she is now. Mm. Wow. Whoa. Okay, Anthea, you haven't seen yourself yet. No, yes. so, she hasn't um, seen her brows, so this is her first time. Okay, so why don't you take a look? Oh, God. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, what do you think of your new brows? These are mine. Oh, my God, I don't, I don't have to 
pencil them and off guess in what? the morning. When you go swimming, they're still gonna be there. Oh my God. <laughs> I love oh, that. Wow. So that means that. Anthea and I both loved our microbladed brows. Thank you so much, Sheila, for wowing Anthea's brows.